perhaps the most fundamental the most necessary component in the movement into yourself is the growing trust of the way things are. You know, every construct has its particulars But if one is honest about it and investigates in a very serious way, what becomes very self-evident is the nature of every construct is distrust. As a matter of fact, in the complete and total absence of all distrust, it is not possible to generate a thought. The very nature of thought is driven by this preconditioned distrust of things. An attempt to understand, to figure out, to manipulate, to understand, to control. An attempt. And as all attempting, in its roots, if one is very serious, in watching the nature of attempting, there will always be found the conditioned element of distrust. In the grace of these teachings, in the grace of what most everyone in this room has tasted, is that every single thing that arises, regardless of the experience, arises out of one source. And everyone has had openings, and in that opening is the birth of true trust. And what is it the true trust of? It is the true trust of the arising of every single thing. It is not the trusting of the mind's thoughts about things. Thoughts are generated from the condition from the egoic condition of distrust. But in true trust, there is the trust of the mind's distrust. In the recognition of true trust, what will be brought into the light is every way the conditioned construct has been built upon its interpretation of why trusting is unsafe. Mind goes to war with mind, attempting to create mental trusting. But in trust, the war is not of significance, because there is the recognition 
it is all arising out of one source, that there is no place that God is more than any other place. There begins to be the trust of all things. what is discovered very early on as this begins to root is that all suffering lies in the hands of alignment of personal relationship with mental distrust. Distrust is not a problem, even relationship with distrust is not a problem when there is the recognition of trust. Immediately there is the taste of something so much bigger than whatever the phenomenal display is displaying. Immediately there is the taste of something that is untouched by all the turbulence. Immediately the resting heart, what is unmoving, is recognized because this is where trust arises from. It is not a searching. Searching arises as the result of personal relationship, personal identification, with distrust. Whether there is a holy battle or the taste of pure nectar, trust remains unchanged. One burning away the walls of numbness, the other opening the heart into the celebration of its true nature. <laughs> 